Hey guys, it's Wendy Hardnack, and I am so excited. I am finally planting in my raised bed. And don't pay any attention to me. I am dirty from head to toe. I have been planting peppers. Lots of peppers, hot peppers. I've planted Gallardia. Planted um, Blazing Star for the butterflies. And cucumbers, seedlings. I was trying to get all my melons, mulch, my honeydew, my um, all my melons. Oh no, kitty. Don't even go there. He's thinking it's a new litter box, but we're going to have to keep him out of here. He's a pill. This is the best thing in the world, is this new raised bed. This is going to help me so much. Ah, uh, I just, I can't do the ground anymore. Um, it just hurts too much. And I can't fight the Bermuda. It's just awful. So I have several trays of these. This is an American flag leek. And it's a really nice variety. And I got it from uh, Hudson Valley Seed Library. And uh, pretty excited. And I plant several in here. And then you flip it. it out kind of like that and then you take each one out with their little root system and you plant them and they will get big pretty darn quick oh my goodness this is just so much nicer I like leeks a lot I don't like buying them in the store they're they're not that great and so this is a much much nicer variety especially when you can grow your own and set this right there and pull these out these got pretty dry which is fine get ready to water them and then we're gonna get some rain tonight I'll just give them a little moisture and I'll plant all these on this side and then I'll head over to the other side to plant those while I have all my rows. You want to plant leeks in full sun. And they just have a marvelous flavor. I'm looking forward to these. The American flag leek is one that stands straight up and it looks like an American flag when it's growing really pretty variety. This is pretty darn nice. Oh my goodness. I have been waiting for several months for this to get done. We're waiting for the soul to be delivered. And finally got that delivered. And we're going to have to get another round soil. I'm going to empty that. He's got to help me get the plastic. He's putting some wheel things on the commander on the can -Am. And so I'm in my garden getting all this stuff done. Getting as much as I can planted. I'm pretty far behind, but it's all right. I just think it doesn't matter at this point. At least it's getting planted finally. I have all these. If some of these didn't make it, I just dump the soil in here. It's not that big a deal. I have several trays. So I'll have a nice big selection of leeks. And it's the only variety I grew the American flag. And if they're not even, it's alright. And 
don't have to be perfect, even though I'd like them to be. Sometimes I put two of them by accident. That's all right. I'm just excited to get this done. I've been planting like crazy. I had to go to the city today, and I hate going to the city. But I met my friend up in the city, and uh, she gave me a couple buckets of veggie scraps. Um, the other girl that was saving veggie scraps for me once the COVID hit, she just had a new baby, and I didn't hear from her, so I'm assuming she needed to take a break. Oh, here comes my hubby. He got something to put on the wheels to make it stronger and so that they won't tip over. They won't lean when we're doing donuts in the snow. We have a lot of fun for retired folks. There's like a couple kids. I was kind of hoping it wouldn't rain this weekend. We have a lot to do, and it looks like we're going to get rain tonight, this weekend. Oops, I'm getting these way out of alignment. I'm talking. I'm not paying attention. And, uh, I totally messed all that up. Oh, well. You know what? It's all good. You all get the gist of it. I'm just making a big mess here. I'm short. I'm only five foot. So it's really hard for me to garden. But, ta-da! So, there's one tray. Several leeks. Then I'll go get the rest of the trays. They will go in here. And it's going to look nice. Look at my view. Isn't it pretty? And then, yes! And as soon as this one gets full, when we put the plastic in, we're going to wait for the um, wind to die down and get the plastic in. Then we're going to get the burnt trees put in the bottom for kind of a raised bed hugo culture. And it's going to look nice. I love my garden. It's start to look pretty. I can't wait till we have all raised beds and then I can use those tubs in another section of the farm. Then I can just grow my roughwoods in all the tubs and secured locations. It would be really neat. Well, thanks for watching, guys. I have another tray of leeks. Matter of fact, I got several of them. Fill up the back of this bed. And clouds coming in. Dogs coming in. Husband dropped the mulch on the plastic for me so I can get those raised beds back there mulched. They have green beans, eggplant, and melons. So I intercrop those three things together. Ta-da! Oh my gosh. I'm in such a good mood. Okay, y'all. Have a good evening.